Clum, Skylar Morton, I'm 17. And I've been training here since 1999 and I just graduated from the program in 2011. I'm attending UCLA. The coaching staff at JTCC is amazing. When I first came here, I was coached by Bessa, mainly, um, Razel Lightfoot, and this other coach, Misty. And they started me out, and they got me to love tennis from when I was really little, and they got me competing right away. Then um, later, when I, I guess I was like 13-ish, um, Frank Salazar became my mentor coach. He helped me a lot. Like, he was really good for my technique, and he really helped me. And then um, Coach Creasy became my mentor, mentor coach, and he's helped me a lot with the mental game and, like, competition. That's really good. And then um, I've been working a lot recently with Nathan, who's helped me with everything, um, like, mentally, technique, everything, and it's been really great. Probably when I was 13, um, I started getting more serious about tennis and I decided that JTCC would be the best place to develop my game. My biggest tennis accomplishment has probably been winning Spring Super Nationals in Alabama this year and winning the South Carolina ITF. A young player should always set goals because then they always have something to work towards um, and it'll be easier to work hard because some days you don't feel like working as hard and you might be tired or something and you'll always keep pushing yourself because you want to reach your goals and that's what helped me um, through my life and it continues to help me. My personal goals were usually reachable. They might have been like tough when I first made them, but um, yeah, they're reachable. Like I had goals to reach a certain ranking by the end of the year. Like maybe well, every year I had like reached one in the section, and that was reachable, and I did that. And then I'd have goals to win certain tournaments or like. Um, get to certain rounds in certain tournaments and always felt good to reach them. Then I set them even harder and those felt good also. Um, I also had technical goals like for the past, I guess, two years I've been working on my backhand a lot and it's like finally like working out and I'm hitting it really well right now so I'm really happy about that. I just think it's really good to set goals because it really helps. I have been keeping my grades up like all through high school because I know that to get into colleges they don't just look at your tennis, um, they look at your grades too and you always just have to have good grades like throughout high school they look at your GPA for all those four years and um, you just have to keep your GPA up because that is a really big factor to getting into good college. Sacrifices. Um, I mean, I know I've made a lot of sacrifices because I've been going to school online um, at the academy, and like I know that a lot of my friends from like my old school like can hang out after school and like go to a lot of parties and stuff, and like I can't do that because I'm always on the court, and then when I'm not on the court, I have to study like to make up for the time I've been on the court not studying. So that's a sacrifice I had to make. And, I think it was, I'm, I'm glad that I made it. Through the mentoring program at JTCC, I've learned to teach 
children to love tennis the way I do. This past summer I went to Turkey Thicket and I taught some children um, at their after school program and it was really fun teaching them. They were really excited to learn tennis and um, they really grasped it, grasped it quickly and a lot of them are really talented and they probably wouldn't even have known like if we hadn't have come there and taught them. Normal day is I wake up at 7.30, we have to go to fitness, which starts at 8, 8 to 9. Then right after that, I have to run to class, sweaty, <laughs> and sit there and learn stuff for until 12 o'clock. And then we have practice 12.30 to 3, and then we have to take an ice bath, and then some days I have class after that or I just go back to my room and study until dinner, and I have dinner, and I study again. My hopes for the future is to go pro and be top 10 WTA. <laughs> cut. I have to cut this.